Some tense moments at Billings West High School today as the school was ordered to shelter in place. That decision came after three separate incidents over the last few days. It was a swift action taken by new superintendent Dr. Irwin Garcia to maintain the safety and security of the school community. As David Jay finds out, it was also a decision that was appreciated by students. We're told that the shades on the windows were pulled, the doors were locked and closed in the classrooms, and students waited it out. One parent who didn't want to be on camera said the communication from the school was good, and the students say the shelter-in-place procedure worked smoothly. Neighbors near West High School called police about suspicious behavior, and an officer suggested the shelter-in-place. Basically stay in our rooms, don't go in the halls, don't go use the bathroom, stay in class until the shelter-in-place is lifted. Axel Dodderweich was at the Career Center when the incidents in shelter in place happened on Wednesday morning, but she's been through similar drills. We do stay calm. We Teachers definitely like uh, show that, present that to students because they know that raising panic is not going to do any good. People can get hurt when there's raising panic, so it's just a mental thing. Students say they did not know the reason for the shelter in place and everyone knew what to do. They announced that we were having it and everyone just kind of followed as they should as they were trying to. Locking the doors, making sure everything is secure and just kind of went on with class. Everyone was very calm about it. Uh, everyone was just asking what was happening, asking questions about it. Dr. Erwin Garcia alerted parents partly on the School District 2 Facebook page. A gentleman apparently was uh, looking into cars and vehicles around the area and houses. We had another individual apparently uh, stopping girls coming to the school and asking them questions, random questions. Then we have another report of another person actually talking to the girls and saying some improprieties. Parents commented on Facebook thankful for the information. Dr. Garcia says police have a license plate number and the school district is doing what it can to help with the investigation. We definitely take this seriously. We, you know, we want to make sure that every child that comes to school feels safe. How safe do you feel at school? Very safe, honestly. I feel safe. The safety here is really good. In Billings, David J, MTN News.